moving average, right? Uh, you know, while we were speaking in the, in the past, you know, you know, few minutes, we actually went as low as 271, which is a 50-day moving average. And you know, in these kind of trading, 75% of the time, market will hold this level. All right, so 270 is a good support, right? It goes back to all the way through July 20th, so you know, basically two months. And I would watch if this level will hold. You know, in if next week or in the next two weeks, if you see that the 50-day moving average holds, but sometimes it does overshoot, right? We've seen 50-day moving average where it overshots. Uh, then uh, as it curls back up and start going back up, that's where I would take that 30% of the cash and start deploying, you know, maybe take 10% of that cash to repair your position or deploy it back into the stock market. Because I think this is, you know, there's nothing fundamentally wrong with the technology sector. This is kind of the pillar of the of the stock market. I think it will underperform the value stocks, but there's nothing wrong with the Microsoft earnings or Apple earnings. These are strong stocks. They're just way overbought, right? From technical perspective, you know, usually you don't, you know, market doubled in size, right? We went from 171 to 300, which is not an, you know, that's not a normal price action. It needs some kind of a short-term breather. And I think that's what, you know, I thought it's going to happen in August. You know, it happened first week in September. That's fine. But that's, you know, so that's where how we would use that cash.